Hi, my name is Yama Rivera Matos, and I'm here today with Sarah Biswas. Along with another colleague, Angela Echevarria, we are researchers at the Grassroots Energy Innovation Lab in the Center for Energy and Society at Arizona State University. We are excited to share research with you. We study energy system, meaning we study technology, people, and places. A key challenge facing the energy transition today is to make a carbon-free energy system that is economically and socially productive for people. In other words, how can the energy transition achieve both climate and social goals? Gains can be powerful tools in bringing out the challenges that prevent people, expert, and the general public, public to collaborate meaningful about explore sustainable futures. Through the games you develop for in this edition of Climate Jam, we hope that you can inspire people to think creatively about producing newer form of value from using energy. Our experience in communities around the world has highlighted that the need to pay close attention to the human and social aspect of designing renewable energy system. In this video, we offer three findings from our research so that there can be a creative thinking about the value of energy for societies and the environment. The first key idea is about understanding that the design of energy system is not merely a question of selecting the most economically, economical and durable technology for producing energy. Rather, it is an exercise that requires technology, technology selection to be determined by a clear understanding of the social, cultural, and economic goals of the people and community it serves. For example, in the community of Vegeta Sama in central Puerto Rico, people came together to build a social capital and a self governance project. They use solar energy projects to generate resilience to natural hazards and sustainability by starting solar energy panels with batteries and training also themselves on how to operate and maintain these technologies. The second key idea is that social design is not possible without adequate representation of different perspectives, motivations, and incentives in society. Thus, platforms and channels are necessary to identify and constructively engage stakeholders across the board, enabling social design. For example, in Sierra Leone, we found that more inclusive design choices can be made by broadening the definition of stakeholders and not simply have engineers and economists make choices. This meant finding ways to reach well-sourced information and informants that reduce assumptions about how other people live their lives and what their aspirations are. The third idea is about making good design choices. With the information collected and collective goals identified, design choices and implementation decisions are still to be made. Well-informed design choices on or energy decisions consider multiple possibilities, the benefits, the burdens and potential consequences of the energy system choices in the immediate, medium and long term. We call this the social value of energy. In this example from the Philippines, you see several ladies participating in a session to identify the kinds of benefits they would like to draw from a community solar project. What are their constraints and what burdens the energy system should not create? The engineers and planners are listening and taking notes to use them as inputs for designing the energy system. The three ideas we have shared have been particularly important findings from our research that can make energy transitions carbon neutral as well as socially valuable at the same time. Going forward, a critical opportunity lies in augmenting energy decisions at all levels creating better visual maps and scenarios of benefits, burdens, and potential consequences. In other words, visualizing the social value of energy will be instrumental for aligning renewable energy solutions to local socioeconomic development, social and environmental justice, and climate resilience, among other sustainable development goals. We invite you to exercise your creativity and help all stakeholders, the general public, scientists and engineers, policymakers, to think together and creatively about making energy choices that create value for society in multiple ways. We would love to answer any questions that you may have. 
email us. This is Saurabh Biswas with GMR Rivera Matos. Thank you. Thank you.